on CWN. Are you going to the game tonight? And did you dress up for Spirit Day? I'm Ashlyn. And I'm Gracie, and you're watching Cal Allen Wildcat News. Come explore Wait. Cal Allen ISD, a place where teachers care for students and encourage them to explore their full potential with confidence and enthusiasm. At Cal Allen, our extracurricular activities frequently compete at the state level. And thanks to our dedicated faculty and staff and our innovative use of technology in the classroom, we rank number one academically in all of South Texas. Just off of Interstate 37 and a short 20 minute drive from downtown Corpus Christi, come join us at Cal Allen, where winning is a tradition. Good morning, Con High School. Today is Friday, August 31st, 2018. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and the Pledge to the Texas Flag. The Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. Are you planning on attending a Texas college or taking dual credit classes next semester or next year? Then you need to take the TSI. The next TSI is on Saturday, September 15th at 8 a.m. here at CHS. Registration forms are available with Ms. Dragu in the College and Career Center. Deadline for registration is tomorrow at 4 o'clock. Cal Allen High School will be hosting the first blood drive of the year next Friday, September 7th from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. Each donor will get a shirt, a coupon to Nolan's Restaurant, a drink, and a snack. And I hope you all are ready at the phones because it's time for the daily giveaway. Here's Elena with today's question. Today's giveaway is brought to you by Southern Charm, your local home cooking restaurant. Today's question is, what sprint legend made his debut with the Australian soccer team Central Coast Mariners last night? Be the first call 7702, correct the answer to win. Back to you guys. Don't forget to call in after 305. <laughs> Students with the late tutorial bus will begin running on Tuesday of next week. You must have turned in your name to Mrs. Elmore in room 503 if you plan to ride this bus. Seniors, if you are interested in buying a senior tile, you can go by and pick up an order form from outside of Miss Dietrich's room, room 507. And we have some example ones for you from, from last, last year. year. Yes. And seniors, make sure if you have given your name to Coach Radford for a reservation that you go by and pick up your paper. And coming up next, Caitlin will have the rundown on sports. But first, this short message about Spirit Day. Hey, kids. Do you like spirit? Hey. You like costumes? Well, have I got a treat for you. Because for the next three months, Cal Allen High School is going to be having Spirit Days! Oh. In case you're not in the know, Spirit Day is a pep rally event where we want all the students to dress up in all sorts of costumes. However, each day has a specific theme that must be followed. For example, we have Candyland Day, Fiesta Day, Pink Out Day, Heroes and Villains Day, and Senior Dress Up Day. What are you dressed up as, sir? A senior. And this year something extra special is happening. That's right, my friend. For you see, this year we're going to have extra super special fantastic amazing prizes given out. Because get this, one person from each class is going to receive a super awesome special prize. Such as, um, uh, this motorcycle helmet or, um, can of bug spray and other amazing gifts. Wow, I sure am excited, aren't you? <laughs> yes, my friend. Oh, we should probably mention, there is a few rules to this Spirit Days. Um, dress code, such and such. However, they're very boring and uncool. So, while we show you the rules in text form, we're going to dance for you. Thank you. 
Well, that about covers it. So, get ready to show your school spirit this Friday, and for all the ones to follow. Happy dressing! <laughs>you guys and good morning Wildcats. Our football team will start the new season with a home game tonight against San Benito. Good, good, good luck boys. Our volleyball teams will also be playing here at home against Victoria West. The varsity girls will start at five and the freshman and JV teams will follow at six. Good luck girls. During the pep rally today the CCPD will present a certificate to Miss Neth about last year's shoe donations. Boys Soccer are selling the newest edition of practice shirts for $15. If you would like to purchase one, just find a soccer player or speak with Coach McGinnis in room 427. Well, that's the latest on Catlin Sports. Back to you guys. We've got some footage of the student council debates that are starting to heat up. Let's take a look. here with Oscar. He's running for sophomore vice president. How are you feeling about elections coming up and what are you hopeful for? Feeling a little nervous, but you know what? I'm hoping for the best for me and my competitors and all those running. And you know, it's been a lot of hard work. Each poster I make, I make by hand and I put them up all by myself. And uh, yeah, I'm hoping for the best. Well, that's great. Well, good luck, Oscar. That's all for me. Now back to you. Thank you, and are you interested in a certain career path? Well, he, then here's your chance to learn about these opportunities. The College and Career Center has 40 seats available for CHO students to attend, you choose. Stop by and see Ms. Dragu for more information and to sign up. If you are interested, sign up. If you're interested, sign up by next Wednesday. Class officer elections will begin today and will close next Wednesday at 4 p.m. You can access the ballots for your class by going to the student inter intranet page and clicking on your class's link. You may vote one time. Good luck to all nominees. You must have a parking permit in order to park in the parking lot. If you do not have a sticker on your car, you will either get a boot or get towed. Many people have got the boot already. They are not joking around. To get a permit, go to the front office with your insurance, license, and a completed parking permit form. And Philip will have the weather for you right after this short message. Hey, yo, Megan and Cass, what's up, what's huh? Up? Thank you guys and good morning Wildcats. Right now we're looking at temperatures at around 91 degrees with minimal chances of rain and winds out of the east-southeast at about 15 miles an hour. Throughout our day we are looking at temperatures in the 80s increasing into the 90s then dropping back down into the 80s tonight with minimal chances of rain and winds out of the east-southeast at around 7 to 13 miles an hour. And with that let's go and throw it to Morgan right outside for our weather outlook. Thank you. Uh, your regularly scheduled weatherman is not here today, but um, I, Officer Dixon, is he I'm here to tell you the weather. Uh, it's mostly cloudy out here, probably going to be 91 degrees around 3 o'clock. Um, it's sunshiny on this end, but very cloudy over to the, to the west of us. Kind of reminds me of the day that my, uh, my family abandoned me. Started off sunshiny and nice, but then it slowly got grayer. Well, that's all for me. Now back to you. Thank you, Morgan. Now on our regional radar, y'all, you do see that we do have some rain coming into our region, so just be on the lookout for that throughout the next couple of days. Now on our U.S. radar, we do see that down, once down here that we have our rain coming in from Florida with, with rains up here in the Kansas region, so just be on the lookout for that throughout the next couple of days. Throughout our next three days, we are looking at temperatures in the 90s with lows in the 70s with a 40 to 50 percent chance of rain with winds in the southeast at around 15 to 20 miles an hour. And we are looking at pretty rainy skies this weekend, so if y'all have any plans, just be safe. <laughs> well, thanks, Philip. And just a reminder, if you miss a show, you can always access it at any time at youtube.com slash user slash TV. And that's all your announcements for today, but now it's time for your joke of the day. So, guys, how does a train eat? I don't know, Gracie, how? 
it goes choo choo. <laughs> <laughs> and for all you social people out there, make sure you're following us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat at Crown TV for all latest updates. Also, subscribe to us here on YouTube to catch all of our latest videos. And as always, stay, stay classy, Cal Allen. Allen.